Filthy Phil just finished up at Millville, 13-12 for 13th. Um, I know you're not going to be totally stoked, but tell me something positive from today. Give me something. There's nothing positive, man. It's fucking shitty. I sucked. <clears throat> um, I have no fitness, pussyitis, and then um, it's pretty much it. It's fucking, it's a disgrace, actually. So It's hard. I'm trying to fucking build back, and yeah. I can't, so I don't know. Well, when you say you can't, what what is? What ah, because I can't handle the workload during the week, especially after Southwick. Just trying to. We're up here all week in Minnesota. We had a bunch of stuff we had to do, and it's just, I don't know. I'm just a bit devastated, pissed off. Could headbutt somebody. So. Yeah. Well, <laughs> Steve and I were up there watching, and we knew when. I guess when Freddie was coming, and then Chiz right behind him, yeah. that had to make it even that much worse. Yeah. Well, no. I mean, they're riding good too. It's just. Um, you know, the first 15 minutes was good for me, second moto. Uh, you know, I can run the pace and I can stay there. It's just when well, my body gives out, my legs, I just don't have nothing. So uh, it's a double-edged sword for me. You know, I can ride two days during the week and then my wrist is sore. And then I come on the weekends and I end up getting tired. It's just like, I don't know, I got to, uh, yeah, and it's just hard coming back mid-season. So I don't yeah, have a base trying to build it back. So. Yeah, you have to look at it that way, I think. I know it's hard as a professional athlete. You want to be back at the, where you feel like you should be right away, but it does nah, take just, time, man. Yeah, it's just, fuck, I don't know. <laughs> I hate excuses, but it's just, it's part of it. I, yeah. like I said, I, I'm falling apart out there. Literally, my body gives away. So, um, and this track was really hard on my wrist. The uphill triple was gnarly. It was a really mm -hmm. hard landing. And then coming down Mount Martin was really hard to hang on as well. So it's like, and then the rollers were pretty gnarly. So, yeah, it was just a demanding track. I, uh, yeah, I just... Yeah, I fucking fell apart. So it's been two weeks in a row of d demanding tracks. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. So it's so, uh, yeah, maybe I should be a little easier on myself. But um, yeah, the reality is you you want results and stuff to come quicker, but uh, it doesn't. It takes a while to build. So um, yeah, we'll get back, try and ride this week once or twice, and get ready for Washu because it's yeah, a big travel week. After Washu, you get another break, so that'd be probably be good. Yeah, for and you. then then I, you know. I'd like to put in a really heavy workload if I can and then kind of chill a little bit before Unadilla. So, yeah, I got my work cut out for me for the next couple of weeks. So I'm, I'm still trying to build a base so everybody else can kind of relax. So, um, yeah, it's just weird. Like, you know, guy like Anderson, last week I passed him second mode on Southwick, dead tired, and then this week he gets third. So I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I missed this week, but uh, – yeah, we'll we'll see. Just need he didn't to. finish the second moto though. No, nah, he went down, but he still got third to first moto. Yeah, sure. I if I got third to first moto, I wouldn't race the second moto either. You know, so. <laughs> um, yeah. yeah, it's just yeah, like I said, it's fucking depressing. So we'll keep building. Last thing, just the track in general. You said it was rough, but you know, Alex Martin running the thing, your buddy. Mm -hmm. I mean, pretty good race weekend overall. A lot of people here. Yeah, no, I mean, spectator wise, it's unbelievable. I don't think they've had this many people here since. Ricky's last year in 06 or 07 so I think uh, I think it was a record numbers which is awesome for the family but uh, we need to work on a little bit more track prep and see where uh, I just don't feel like we have the topsoil that it used to have here it's pretty got a hard pack base and uh, the sandiness and the ruts kind of went away there was not many ruts so um, yeah we'll see what happens I think they know that they uh, got to rip it and try and get another digger or a different tractor to help pull it so uh, i talked to big al about it but uh big al's advice do more cardio during the week <laughs> thanks bro appreciate it <laughs> dumbass <laughs> but yeah we'll get ready for washugo all right man phil thank you thank you